Hey, what's going on guys? My name is Dominic Nikolai, and today, well, uh, tonight and tomorrow rather, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be taking you through uh, one of my days, what it's like, uh, what I normally do. Um, so right now, I figured I'd just start it off during the uh, nighttime because this is part of what I do. Uh, being, um, you know, right now I'm about to do cardio, and I'm also gonna do um, about a half mile of body weight lunges because uh, tomorrow I have a photo shoot for one of nutrition so i'm kind of just going to show you guys what i'm doing for that and um what i've been doing for that i've uh, basically cleaned up my diet quite a bit for this last week in preparation for this shoot um it is with one of their uh videographers so i don't want to come unprepared because that's not very professional and not only that but it's not going to make for very good content if i don't look uh that great so as you can see i'm a little bit flat and uh, watery right now uh, mostly because I'm on kind of low calories and I haven't uh, done any cardio yet. But tomorrow I'm going to give myself, or tonight I'm going to give myself a spray tan. Tomorrow I'm going to have a little bit more food in me, so I should look uh, hopefully like a whole different person tomorrow. We'll see how I do. And there's my 30 minutes daily. <clears throat> now it's time for lunges. All right, so I never did it this way before, but it seems to make sense to me right now. I'm wearing knee pads because I wanna do a uh, just a quick tap of the knee on the concrete. And uh, that way I'm ensuring that I'm going down the exact same amount for every single rep, since obviously you can't do um, a repetition on both legs at the same time because it's a single leg lunge. Um, and I'm doing it for half a mile, so I don't wanna scuff up my knees. So that took about 30 minutes. Um, the point of that is not really to be a workout. It was more so to just kind of stimulate my legs and give my upper body a little rest. Since that's, since that's, since that is what I want to look good. Since that's what I want to be looking good for tomorrow's photo shoot, I wanted to work my legs to give my upper body a chance to recuperate so it has a nice strong pump tomorrow for the photo shoot. So here's what I'm gonna have for dinner. I'm gonna have a half a pack of this, one pack of uh, frozen brown rice from Trader Joe's, a bit of barbecue sauce, and I have my crushed uh, frozen spinach that I bought fresh at the grocery store, froze it and then crushed it up and put it in this bag um, because it keeps a lot better and that way I can just sprinkle it into my, into my hot food and then it just honestly cooks itself within the hot food. So this whole meal that I'm about to eat is gonna be about 600 calories and it's gonna, I think it, I think it's about like $4.50 for this meal for 600 calories. And if I wanted to make it like a thousand calories, all I'd simply have to do is maybe add like 200, 200 grams of uh, olive oil, then maybe have like a glass of juice on the side of that. And even with both of those things, the meal would still be about, you know, $5 or something like that. And I don't always eat this, but I'm doing, I'm doing it this way out of a matter of convenience this time. So as you just saw, I just finished up the spray tan, and um, tomorrow, I think what I'm gonna do for breakfast is probably some kind of um, oat shake with oat, honey, egg white, cashew butter, salt, spinach, maybe some maca root and uh, stuff like that to just really help me get a nice, solid, clean pump before I do the photo shoot. And not only that, but a pump that's actually gonna last me, you know, however long the video slash photo shoot will take. So I'll show you that. So I'll show that to you guys tomorrow morning. So I just woke up and I'm making that shake that I was telling you guys about right before this. So I got, um, I got egg whites, salt, cinnamon, vanilla, oats, dry carb, um, I got cashew butter, spinach, bananas, and honey. And that's what I'm going to be eating for breakfast and that's going to help me sustain the pump throughout the video shoot. So unfortunately as you can see it's raining right now, which is not ideal because um, I like it to be kind of hot when I'm trying to get like a pump and trying to look vascular and stuff like that. So I'm hoping that the gym is heated. Although, I'm not sure that it's going to be because it's kind of like a a, ware, a small warehouse style of gym. But uh, we'll see when we get there. Alright guys, here we are. 
All right, so I forgot a shaker cup, so we're gonna go back to my house and get the shaker cup. Um, that's about it. So we're back. We got the stuff that I needed, um, and now we're just gonna kind of figure out what uh, what we're about to do. Yeah. So this is Alex, uh, one up videographer, and uh, today we're here to get that good content that I was telling you guys about. Stay tuned. So I don't know if you guys could tell. Uh, I mean, I'm hoping it's coming across in video, but I feel like I do look a lot better than I did um, last night. It was carb, can, sleep. I think it did me pretty well. Three, two, one, go. Three, two, one, go. What's up, guys? So I'm here at uh, Enhanced Athlete in Sacramento. I did a little one-week diet, and I uh, gave myself a spray tan for this uh, video shoot that I'm doing for 1UP today with Alex over there. So I'll show you guys a little bit of behind the scenes. Uh, and the nice thing about tricarb is that it's it's unflavored and it's it's flavorless, so it pairs well with almost anything that. Do you sell the tricarb? No, it's in the other room. Let me just only try that one in here. Mm -hmm. I personally like to use uh, One of Nutrition's vegan protein line because, you know, vegan protein digests very well. So right now what we're doing is we're kind of just uh, going through some of the products that I like to take and I'm basically explaining why I like to take them and what, what they do for me. So we're doing that and then we're going to get some, um, some workout clips and uh, other stuff like that. So right now uh, we're doing a, uh, like a little workout vlog and and it's gonna be shoulders, so I'll just show you guys what I'm doing for that. Not so much for this video, but for, for that video. But nonetheless, you guys will still see what I'm doing. So the first workout that I'm doing is uh, side delt raises. So we just wrapped up with the uh, first exercise, which is side delt raises. Now we're going to move on to the second exercise, which I'm going to be doing um, cable upright rows. Um, and I'll show you guys what that looks like right now. Oh. So as you guys can probably tell, I do look a lot better than last night, which is exactly what I was hoping for. You do look pretty shredded today. Alright, second set. That's gonna be from a low, a low point to high. Two to half to actually actually balance the weight, causing some different types of muscle fibers to start twitching and activating. Then, as opposed to where you're sitting down, you're not using as many of the stabilizer muscles. This is the fifth and final exercise. Like I said, it's gonna be rear delt flies from a high point to a low point. So, when there's no handles, no grips, no nothing, all I do is I just grab onto this little ball right there, and pretty much any cable machine or any cable stack is gonna. So now we're wrapping up with the. Uh, 
Just some ab workout shots, and, uh, and then we're done. So as you guys may or may not be able to tell, this is obviously kind of like instructional photos as to how you're supposed to do these these sort of app workouts. All right, so we just finished up. Had a good shoot with Alex. Um, yeah, so I can't wait to see what we got, and uh, that's about it for today. So the shoot took about four hours. I'm finally back home now, and um, the shoot went pretty well. I uh, I obviously like to do photo shoots when I'm in a little bit better shape um, as opposed to when I'm not because it makes it a little bit funner for me, and it obviously makes for better content. But um, yeah, I'm curious to see what uh, what it turned out like. And even, even when I'm not shooting with with um, you know a professional videographer or whatever obviously this is what I do on a on a day-to-day -day basis anyways you know just not necessarily with a professional videographer so yeah this is not really just like a once in a while thing like I'm doing this sort of thing like all the time this also is a part of the day of my life right now I'm just trying to screenshot a thumbnail for the video so you know editing photos editing videos healthy eating fitness all that sort of thing is really what um, my life consists of and I know it wasn't a very smooth transition between the clip that you just saw last sitting in my car to now uh, but I realized I didn't film an outro, so this is it. Thank you guys for watching, and uh, I'll see you next time.